All right. And you will see what happens. So she gives a rock to us, that's the task. And we give her a piece of cucumber and she eats it. The other one needs to give a rock to us. And that's what she does. And she gets a grape. And she eats it. The other one sees that. She gives a rock to us now, gets again cucumber. She tests the rock now against the wall. She needs to give it to us. And she gets cucumber again. What can we learn from monkeys about human beings? <laughs> and is, what is the fundamental difference, if there is any, between monkeys and human beings? Monkeys are not human beings. We They're evolved true. from monkeys, but monkeys are not human beings. We're a different species. We function some, by different laws. Some may, some may argue about this. No, nobody could argue with it. We, all, we have the capacity. Some may choose to live like monkeys, but this is the big difference. Monkeys cannot choose to live like human beings, but we can choose to live like monkeys. We have free will. Monkeys do not. We have a conceptual ability. We can invent rockets that take us to the moon. We can zoom across space. Monkeys cannot. You cannot learn anything about human behavior from monkeys. Human beings are so removed evolutionarily from monkeys that it is meaningless to study monkeys in order to understand human beings. We are complete. I mean, we talk. We have complicated conversations. We do experiments on monkeys. They don't do experiments on us. Yeah, Thank wrong. God. So but what about jealousy? Yeah. Does not exist? Jealousy, I mean, it, it depends what you mean by jealousy. The two terms. Jealousy. jealousy. I know that you are right, but I'm jealous. It's painful in my stomach when yeah, you have jealousy is something we learn. It's not something you're, you're, that's ingrained in you. You're not born jealous. It's something you learn. And some of us are not jealous. You know, am I jealous of Bill Gates' billions? No, not at all. I live a good life. I have what I have. I, I wouldn't swap my life for anybody's life. I don't want Bill Gates' life. I like my life. I'm not, I, you know, I might, I might be ambitious to be wealthier and to have a bigger house or bigger but it's not because my neighbor has it people who always want what the neighbor has are miserable people they're unhappy if you live your life based on i want to be like that person i want to you're always looking at other people you're going to be miserable but not everybody's like that and that suggests that it's not wired into us it's not how we are as human beings it's learned and it can be unlearned and to unlearn a lot of that bad stuff, I recommend reading Ayn Rand. Look, it's not that I support je uh, jealousy as a virtue, but uh, I think it's human. Maybe I don't. I think it's, I think it's human. bad. I think it's bad ideas. I think it's bad ideas right. that make us focus on the other instead of focusing on our own, on ourselves. I'm not jealous of 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 LeBron James's ability in basketball. You know, it, it, it's, yeah, but, it, it, but it's even uh, young kids, you see uh, at the, uh, with young kids when they... they Jealousy is not competition. I'm competitive. If I got on a basketball court with LeBron James, I would play against him knowing I would lose. But I wouldn't be mm -hmm. upset by losing to him. But we're competitive. Competition is different than jealous. Young children are competitive. And their parents teach them to be jealous often. Because the parents are jealous. And we teach our children to be jealous. We also teach our children... To share. We teach our children to be good socialists, right? But we don't share as adults, right? Your, your, your young kid is playing in the sandbox with his uh, little cars. And some strange kid comes up and says, I want to play with the cars. And what do the parents say? You say, Go, yo, you got to share. You got to share. Why? Why should the kid share? I mean, he could trade. I'll give you my truck if you have a, uh, a uh, I don't know, a sports car or something. And mm -hmm. you won't share as an adult. If some stranger came up to you and says, I want to borrow your car right now, would you give him the keys? Of course not. And you think your kid doesn't know that and doesn't know you're a hypocrite? 
that you want him to share, but you won't share. So we teach our kids little subtle things about, about the big world and about what we expect from them that we don't even know we're teaching them. What we need today, what I call the new intellectual, would be any man or woman who is willing to think. Meaning, any man or woman who knows that man's life must be guided by reason, by the intellect, not by feelings, wishes, whims, or mystic revelations. Any man or woman who values his life and who does not give, want to give in to today's cult of despair, cynicism, and impotence, and does not intend to give up the world to the dark ages and to the rule of the collectivist brutes. All right, before we go on, reminder, please like the show. We, we've got 163 live listeners right now, uh, 30 likes. That should be at least 100. I figure at least 100 of you actually like the show. Maybe there are like 60 of the Matthews out there who hate it. But, but at least the people who are liking it, you know, I want to see, see a thumbs up. There you go. Start liking it. I want to see that go to 100. All it takes is a click of a, a, click of a, a thing, whether you're looking at this. Uh, and, and, you know, the likes matter. It, it's not an issue of my ego. It's an issue of the algorithm. The more you like something, the more the algorithm likes it. So, you know, and if you don't like the show, give it a thumbs down. Let's see your actual views being reflected in the likes. But uh, if you like it, don't just sit there, help get the show promoted. Of course, you should also share and uh, you can support the show at youronbookshow.com slash support or on Patreon or Subscribestar or Locals uh, and, uh, and show your support for, all, for, for, for the work, for the value hopefully you're receiving from this. And, uh, and of course, don't forget, if you're not a subscriber, even if, you, even if you just come here to troll or even if you're here like Matthew to defend Marx, uh, then uh, you should subscribe because that way you'll know when to show up. You'll know what shows are on, when they're on. You'll get notified, right? So, um, yes, like, share, subscribe, support. Like, share, subscribe, support. There you go. Easy. Do one or all of those, please. <laughs>